In this lesson we're going to look at doing arc text or text on arc which means applying text to a circle. So to do this we need to come over to the left hand side here and click on this flyout and come down and click on arc text and that gives us a cursor and if I hold down my mouse button I can position that where I want it, let go of that and then I can type in something like arc text and if I come over to the edge here of the circle it turns blue and I can make it smaller or larger as so. I can come to the centre node here and move it to any position that suits me and get it just the way I want it to be. Now the good thing about arc text is that you can actually do lines of text so if I press enter on the keyboard I can type in arc text again and I can keep doing this and make line after line of text. Now the other thing you can do, I'll just zoom this down a little bit and bring it down to show you. The other thing you can do is use these tools up in the top right hand corner here, these arc text tools, and you can set the position that the text flows. So if we wanted the text to flow above and below we click on this button and as you can see it, it flows above and then it flows below. I can also set it to flow below and here if I want to bring this out away from the circle I just position my cursor, press enter and then now the text flows away from the circle. Now I'll put it back to above and below. Another tool you have here, or the, another node, is this node here. This lets you resize and also spin the arc around. So you can get any sort of position or effect you want to create. And if you want to set the positions and sizes numerically you've got all these tools up here to do this. So I can set the diameter say exactly 3 inches. I can reset the position and if I wanted to change the X and Y for example I might set the X to say 5.5 inches and I might set the Y to say 5.5 inches. And now the arc is set exactly where I set it to be. I'll move it back to where I wanted here. The other thing with arc text is the text itself is treated like regular text. So I can just select this text like any normal text and I can change its colour as so. I can make it bold, I can italicise it, etc, etc. In other words the text is just regular text but it happens to be flying around a circle. I can also for example come in here and change the font to another font. So I can do all those sorts of things with arc text. I don't have any limitation to how much text I put. And on page 2 here you can see that if we zoom in, here you've got lots and lots of arc, or lots and lots of text going around the arc. And if I zoom back out, I can make that above and below, and below as normal, and really do the sorts of things I want to do. Ideal for doing jobs where you've got a uh, a circular element that you need text flying around it like a CD or whatever it happens to be um, and that's the sorts of things you can do with arc text. And that's the end of this lesson.